I also give a tremendous amount of credit to uh, John Tateishi. I think he really has, he was one person that was not given the credit that's due him because uh, people just accepted some of the things that he did as if it's, it's the uh, normal thing that he should do. Well, he knew that it was something that he should do, but I think people forget how effective he was in turning especially uh, the uh, Nisei sentiment who were not for redress. Uh, and I think his whole uh, plan was to f uh, change the focus from monetary uh, uh, issue to constitutional issue. And he did this very well. Because uh, 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 I w uh, when I saw many of these wealthy farmers who used to be anti-redress come up to him, shake his hand, and say, uh, I now have changed my mind. I support the redress movement. Uh, that was the uh, uh, proof to me that John was effective in not uh, changing uh, the, the Anise's uh, idea of uh, 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 being afraid of redress. They were, uh, I think he made them feel that, uh, yes, it might be difficult, but they were willing to uh, stick out their neck now and, and fight for it. And I think it was John's uh, doing. So I think that John had a tremendous effect on the uh, uh, redress movement.